Hi everyone. Um, I've been wanting to go field herping for a while now, um, and since today is a beautiful day, I think I'm going to go um, try and find some reptiles, amphibians out in the wild. It's pretty good. Um, I think I have a, a creek area, a wash um, around my house, so I'm just going to do that um, just because I don't really know what I'm doing. This is my first time herping and I don't have anybody to go with and I don't really know where to go. Um, but the creek does bring in a lot of reptiles. Uh, when I was little I used to catch the garter snakes, um, fence lizards, the blue belly fence lizards, and uh, Pacific tree frogs. So um, I'm hoping to find something like that. There's also alligator lizards out there. Um, it might be still a little early um, to catch to get some things. Um, I'm not going to catch them. I'm just going to look at them, videotape them, and release them um, because you shouldn't take wild things out of the wild. Um, even though I am a reptile lover and do have reptiles, and yes, at one time they were brought out of the wild, um, it's just a good idea to leave wild animals in the wild. So, all right, enough of my preaching. Let's, let's go. Okay, so here we are, and here's the creek, and I am such a rebel, but we're going to go anyway. As you can see by the tire tracks, it's been, you know, kids ride their bikes here all the time. Alright, so this is the creek area. Let's see what we can find. I just that was a fence lizard that just went into a little hole. All right, my first reptile. Woohoo! All right, so when I lifted up this rock, I just found another fence lizard, but he ran away before I could videotape him. But yeah, that's pretty cool. He went in there. So an hour later, I'm back. I found a lot of lizards, a couple of them I got on um, camera, um, and that was about it. And on one of the recordings, at the very, very end, you can hear, um, I believe they're bullfrogs or toads, but um, not quite sure. Um, so yeah, you have to listen really closely. So that's what I hear all the time, and I didn't want to go down to that part because it didn't seem 
kosher. <laughs> so, yeah, and on walking back, um, it was really cool. I found these little things. Uh, it's got a little seed packet at the end, and it just reminded me of my childhood because um, in the fall, there used to be a tree out by my elementary school, and um, we call these like helicopters because you throw them up in the air, and then they helicopter down just like that. Did you see that? That's really cool. And we just got so much fun. We just had so much fun doing that that, um, yeah, so brought me back to my childhood. Yeah, if you've ever played with these things, don't quite know what they're called. I know they're a, a seed packet of some tree because that's the seed right there. But uh, And that's what gives it its weight to kind of fall down and it kind of twirls around itself. Anyway, if you've ever played with that, let me know. And yeah, I hope you liked it. Um, I hope that I can go back out again sometime um, to a different area where there are um, more variety of reptiles and amphibians. So, yep. Alright, thanks for watching.